hi this is nipun from fortron and uh, today i'm going to walk you through on how we can share files using onedrive so uh, according to me the biggest usp of onedrive is that it allows you to uh, you know exercise the feature of co-authoring so co-authoring is a capability with which me sitting in in my office in gurgaon and you sitting in your office in delhi uh, we both can work on the same sheet that or or a document or a presentation or anything for that matter right so any changes that i'll be making onto that sheet will be visible to you in real time and vice versa right so i'm just going to show you very quickly how we can do that right so suppose uh, i have logged in into my onedrive using microsoft office 365.com url and i have logged in with my username and password so these are the files that are there on my onedrive suppose this particular uh, file right i want to share it with uh, uh, sanchita right i'll click here right i'll click on share okay and right i'll just write her uh, i'll just enter her email id okay and now this is something very interesting right Uh, so you can actually give rights to anchita that when this file reaches her system whether she should be able to view that file or she she can have the ability to edit that file as well right so it completely depends on the person who is sharing that file or in short it, it that person can be called as the admin of that file right so i have given anchita the right rights uh, with which she could be she she'll be able to edit this file as well okay so i'll click on share and this file will be automatically shared with anchita and she'll get an email uh, saying that nipun has shared this document with you and whenever she'll click on that link she'll be redirected to that same file on the web right so that is the biggest usp so i hope you like this video for uh, more tips and tricks on how to use office 365 uh, more eff effectively kindly uh, subscribe to our uh, video portal and uh, yeah see you bye bye